Cape Bediocno to me is an inspiration from a generation ago. A generation of great, brave men who fought for democracy and human rights. I presently work as a human rights lawyer and the decision to take on this career path is largely inspired by Cape Pediocno and his legacy. I was maybe around 12 years old when someone gave me a copy of A Nation for Our Children. It was a tattered old copy and by that time it was already out of print. Um, the first essay in the book about human rights inspired me to dream big and to dream um, to be a human rights lawyer and work for the great cause of justice. In that very, very famous essay now, he says that no cause is as great as the cause of human rights and to deny uh, one's human rights is to deny one's humanity. And that is something I hold on to in my everyday work as a human rights lawyer. I may not have uh, met Cape Pediocno personally, but I professionally grew around uh, people who have been largely inspired by his legacy and his work, especially as the first uh, chair of the Philippine Human Rights Commission, which is of course now the Commission on Human Rights. I spent uh, a great deal of my early career in the CHR and just being surrounded by people uh, mentored in one way or another and inspired in one way or another by the legacy of Cape Pediocno. Um, I hope that um, his memory, his work, um, is carried throughout the generations. And I hope that this is something that uh, we hold dear uh, collectively uh, as we, we journey on in our fight for human rights and democracy uh, in this country.